All right, all right, all right. All right, we are back with um. Oh, welcome to Fear and Wine. We are back with uh part six of the Evil Within. Um, when we last left off, uh, we met up with the doctor. We found Leslie. We found the doctor's brother, who happened to be taken over. And then uh, we got separated from them by Ruvik, and now we're kind of on our own in uh, a nightmarish type of area. I couldn't find a save, so we had to start immediately in the game. Oh, good. And my fucking favorite part of the game is here. Shit, I'd better run. Yeah, no shit. All right, come on. Yeah. Take him, not me. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, jump! Go down there! Oh god! <laughs> Fuck. Oh, fucking A. She is insta-death. When she's got you, you are dead, son. What is it with you? I was gonna say, she should blow those damn things up. Burn this fuck. Forgot how fucking terrifying she is. It sucks too because there was all those things around her, like where her body popped up originally. It looked like there was a bunch of pickups, and I, I think I didn't get to get them. Go go go! Go 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 go! Shush. Shit, that would have been fucking death, bro. Shotgun shells. One shotgun shell. Jesus. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Whoa. Uh, no. We're good. We're good here, man. Oh, no. What the fuck is he? Oh, no. Uh, was it blood? Nope, now I'm in a hallway. Good. Oh, shit. That's pretty intense. Alright, that's chapter four. Sweet. Uh, we'll go ahead and save our game since we haven't saved it in a minute. Oh, um, I'm trying to remember what her name is, uh, the spider lady. She has a name, it's like Sarah, uh, Laura. Maybe it's Laura? Lisa. I think it might be Lisa. Seems someone wants me hospitalized. Oh, yeah. I agree, sir. This ain't working out too well for you. All right, we got another journal entry. March 2005. The bad news is I've been reassigned a new partner. The good news is that Myra said yes. But even even the bad news isn't so bad. Joseph is a great detective and we're a good team. Crimson City needs more men like him on the force and it's an honor to be working with him. Sometimes it feels like it's uh, feels like bailing out a boat with a giant hole in the bottom. For every crime we solve, it seems there are 10 others that are committed. The KCPD is a thin blue line protecting the populace uh, from the criminals. 
Sometimes it seems like there's more of the, the latter than the former. Crimson City is like uh, Detroit, I guess. Or how Detroit was. Hey, we're back. Necessary for me, my ass. Yeah, you tell him, Sebastian. You tell this creepy fucking... It's been a while since your last visit. Where are you? Oh. I mean, I suppose. It feels like it was just like, you know, ten minutes ago, but... Uh, investigation stalls in serial killer case. Community cautiously optimistic. Citing the lack of new leads, police suspect serial killer may have gone into hiding or moved on. Serial killers don't usually do it. Well, they go into they go into cooldowns. That's what serial killers do. They go into cooldown periods before they end up going on a berserker mode, which is usually how they get caught. All right, we got forty-eight hundred. See what do we want to try to do. Melee damage, eh. No. Weapons. No. How about agony bolts? Um, it's uh, how strong they are, I guess. I haven't really used any of those. Yeah. There we go. So now we can hold six rounds. Okay. Get back to it. Okay. Chapter five, inner recesses. Hello? I hear you crying, so I thought I'd just kick the door in really hard. Uh, I thought I'd burn your corpse. Yeah, I'm not sure if this bitch is gonna come back to life, and I ain't trying to play with that. God damn it, I did not mean to do that. That's the only reason why sometimes I just don't want to have it, like, locked in. But at the same time, you want it locked in just in case, like, you know, you get attacked. But, uh, I think that was my last one, wasn't it? Yep. I just wasted it. I mean, I have full health now, but... I didn't have that much health taken up. I hear people in here, but there's nobody in here. Open up. Oh. I was like, damn it, how'd he hear me? <laughs> hey, he left by some goop. Hear you, bro. Is that an invisible one? Yeah. Oh shit! Oh man, I meant to can push you off, bro. Where are you? God damn it! Fuck off! Alright, you know what? Yeah! Got him. That was pretty, uh, that was pretty alright. Using the fucking flashbang. So now we know how to get him. I'm gonna do that from now on. Which is probably an actual strategy. I just didn't know that. Alright, cool. Cool room. It's 
funny as uh, I, as much as I play this game, I'm like kind of on edge now. That whole shit doesn't uh, make me feel too good. All right. You know, it's funny. I want to say that I'm a, uh, I'm also a better aim in the second one, but that's not fucking true. I can picture myself in the second one, and the aiming in the game's not bad. It's just very precise, and the enemies like move a lot. So, you know, and I'm not the best at like just like twitch shooting either. That's why this isn't a Call of Duty channel. Looks like I have to get down. Looks, man, it looks like I gotta get down. Alright, go down. Alright, there we go. Ammo, we got goop. Uh, we got a creepy doll, that's cool. Hey! God damn it. Just wasted ammo. Oh, there he is. Ah! It's alright, rat. I'm not gonna hurt you. I just wanted to. wanted that stuff. Okay. We all need what's in there. Alright. Oh, I gotta smash it. Okay. It looks like we need a key card. Hmm. Locked. Need to find a key card. Need to find a key card. Okay. All right. All right. Well, we gotta make some more ammo. Uh. Just in case you're not dead. Although I'm pretty sure you would have squirmed. Okay. All right, fifty five hundred. Cool. Just trying to get through here, guys. Don't mind me. All right, all right, all right. Is that a key card? Hospital key card. This key card belonged to one of the hospital staff. It appears to have blood on it from its previous owner on it. That's always good. Alright. Shells. Alright, let's reload the shotgun for sure. Back to, I believe it's just the next room. Oh, shit. God damn it. Yep. Oh my god, no! What the fuck? Get off me! Get off me, sucker face. Wait, oh, shit. Ow! <laughs> Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. And I'm nearly dead. Wow. Well, hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. Alright. Well, first of all, let's uh, go ahead and... Uh, no. No! No, you idiot! Alright. Um... Oh, yeah. Uh, 
what's this? Nope. Okay, we're all loaded up. Oh, yeah, we need to just go ahead and use the health. Might as well. Because these dudes aren't playing no more. They're trying to stop me. Alright. Am I going the wrong way? I don't know how you get lost in this small little room, but you do. Oh. <laughs> Just pushing shit over like, all right, get me out of here. All right. All right, here we are. What's next? Goose. shoot you but I know it's not gonna do anything until waste ammo. Alright. Oh this is a cool part. I remember this. Yeah, you gotta uh, stab. If you press the wrong one, it'll stab you. And then the blood leads and opens up another doorway. Yeah, that's right. I just took a wild guess and I'm glad I got it right. But the symbol's somewhere in the room. See, it goes right there. So that's how you solve that puzzle. That's how you, you know, don't get stabbed. You know what I mean? Oh. So the symbol is... I don't see it yet, but we'll find it. Okay. Oh, uh, well, first we gotta see what the symbols are. Uh, there's a flower. I think, well, it's the flower. There it is, right there. So it's this one. Alright. Another successful puzzle solved. Solution. Whatever, I'm not good with words. Okay, uh, where'd it go? Oh, no, we, got, we just keep doing this. Okay. It might be that brain up in the top corner. We shall see, though. Oh, no. Okay, it's, it's more of this little, like... There you go, it's that one. Bottom right corner. Okay. At first I was like, oh shit, what if I press the wrong one? Uh, Rubik? Assimilation of yeah. subject's consciousness. Initial symptoms. Sharp pain and brain stem and centered on insertion point. Followed by gradual onset of hemorrhaging as capillaries dilate. Over time, degradation of the ego generates strong suicidal tendencies. They lose who they are and become clay, completely reshapable in my image. But not me. Something keeps me from staying completely within. All right. Um, I don't think that was the last one. There should be one more. No, that's it. It's like cool. <laughs> cool door, man. That's not haunting at all. Alright. 
Put a big, big jar of goo. Oh yeah, sweet. It's Joseph. Fuck yeah. Joseph. Joseph. Now this tub and what he's in is very important to understanding the game. You won't understand it yet. Thank God you're okay. I don't know what I am. But it's definitely not okay. You brought me here? So bro, I didn't bring you anywhere. Hang in there, buddy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make everything all right. Oh, I can heal. Okay. That's much better. <coughs> Is it? You're still coughing up your lung. Can't be that much better. Let's get out of here fast. But now we're not alone, and he'll fight alongside us, which that's cool. However, he will, I think he can't, he obviously can die. Alright, um. What's in here? Okay, is this, oh. Alright. Come on, give me something. Alright. Fuck yeah. Got some shells. Oh, shit. Just in case. I don't need that asshole standing up and attacking me. Is there one more? Yeah. Jelly. Okay. Coming out. I believe we can sneak through here. If not, if we get busted, we wake up everyone. Wait for him to come back. Okay, okay. Boom. Got it. Hell yeah. Oh, never mind. I guess we're fucked no matter what. Joseph! Joseph, stay back. Come on. Oh, no. Don't run anymore. Some run here through here like idiots. <laughs> what about the dumbasses? Good. What the fuck? You you should be dead, you fuck. Oh, now he's dead. After he takes a chunk out of my fucking health, he dies. Whatever. Okay. Joseph! That's a Resident Evil 1 uh, reference. The old ass cutscene, not from the remake. In the remake, they don't even yell his name. Alright. What do we got? Is that something? No? Oh. Quitter. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. There's a green goop. Noise. Guess that's it. Uh, 
Here we go. Heading downstairs. Is that a oh no, uh, oh right, yep, I remember this area now. It's just like a bunch of C4 charges. This looks pretty sophisticated. Why would they put a bomb like this? Do you think we can get past it? Stand back. Let me see if I can disarm it. I'm surprised that he just knows how to disarm bombs. That's pretty cool. I mean, it's helpful, that's for sure. Because if he's like, I have no idea what I'm doing, it's like, okay, well... Our journey ends here. Not only did he know how to do it, he did it very quickly. With ease, one might say. What is it with this sound? I thought it was something electronic. Uh -oh. oh shit. Joseph, no! So I think he's the only character who actually can contract it and then kind of fight it off. Which only makes me like him more. That means he's that much of a badass that he's like, ugh, that was rough. I made it go away, though. Joseph, after Connolly, I thought, I don't know what came over me. <coughs> I haven't been feeling well, but... Apologize. There's no I'm sorry. Look, let's just get out of here. There's something wrong with this place. Yeah. I don't even apologize. What a fucking dick. No, I'm just kidding. It's whatever. I actually wish there was DLC where you played as Joseph. But there's only DLC where you play as Kidman. But, hey, you take what you can get. I mean, the DLC with Kidman's cool. It's pretty fun. It's really tough. I do remember that. I think it's because... I don't even think you really fight in it. I think it's mainly, like, stealth. If not all stealth. Alright. I was actually just looking for one of these places. Wait. Is there not a journal in here? A journal entry? Usually there's always a journal entry. We need to move. Alright, I guess not this time. I knew it. Well yeah, when you see the mirrors and they're glowing, it means Whatever you're going one goddamn matter. place. Ah, uh, see, uh, mental patients claim abuse. Abuse only tip of the iceberg. Patients at Beacon Mental Hospital claim they are being moved, moved, being used in behavioral engineering experiments by unknown agency. Hmm. Couldn't be Mobius or anything. All right, let's go let's save our game. Or not save, upgrade, then we'll save our game. Okay, stock. Yeah, let's do a multiplier on that one. And let's do a multiplier on shotgun. Alright, I'm pretty sure we might be too low to do really anything. Wait, hold on. Yeah. It's not worth upgrading that. Uh sure. Let's take off shave off some of the reload time. Why not? All right, guys. Well, that's actually that's gonna be the end of part five. Uh, glad we reunited with Joseph, and we're gonna. Uh, I, this is a part where I kind of forget what the game does. I remember everything leading up to this, and once we get to meet up with Joseph, that's when I start to draw a blank. I know we go to diff like way different areas. The game totally starts going off the rails from here on out. Not that it's been on the rails at all this entire time, but from here on out, it's gonna be pretty fresh to me. Like I said, I've only beaten the game once. If it was the second one, I know that game through and through from beginning to end. But anyway, guys, I hope you're enjoying this. Um, I'll be back with part six soon. Till then, peace.